Hello guys, welcome to Engineering Physicist. So today we will learn about number systems. Before working with numbers, it is essential to be able to represent them in a convenient way. And over the ages of development of number theory, the decimal number system turned out to be the most efficient one. The decimal number system uses digit symbols 0, 1, 2, dot, 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 up to 9 to represent 0 and the first 9 integers. Any larger integer can be represented as such. 372 can be represented in the form 300 plus 70 plus 2 equals 3 into 10 to the power 2 plus 7 into 10 plus 2 and is denoted in the decimal system by the symbol 372. Here, the important point is that the meaning of the digit symbols 3, 7, and 2 depends on their position in the units, tens, and hundred place. This is called the positional representation or the positional notation and is widely used in modern mathematics. In more general terms, a number z equals a, b, c, d can be expressed as z equals a 10 to the power 3 plus b 10 square plus c 10 to the power 1 and d into 10 to the power 0, where the digits a, b, c and d are integers from 0 to 9. We note a property that on successive division of z by 10, the coefficients d, c, b, and a are the left remainders. Generalizing the above nature of representation, any number in decimal system can be expressed as z equals a n 10 to the power n, a n minus 1 10 to the power n minus 1 dot dot dot, a 1 10 to the power 1 plus a naught and can be represented by a n a n minus 1 dot 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 a 1 a naught. In the decimal system, the 10 is singled out to serve as base. The layman may not realize that the selection of 10 is not essential and that any integer greater than 1 would serve the same purpose. For example, a septimal system of base 7 could be used. In such a system, an integer could be expressed as z equals bn 7 to the power n plus bn minus 1 7 to the power n minus 1 dot 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 b1 into 7 plus b0 and represented as bn bn minus 1 dot 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 b1 b0 base 7. Here, bi are the digits from 0 to 6. It is a simple exercise to show that any decimal system number can be converted to any other system by simply dividing with the base and collecting the remainders. For example, 109 in base 10 can be converted to the septimal system in the following way. It turns out, as you can see, that 109 in decimal system is 214 in the septimal system. Two small bases have problems with the arithmetic and two large bases require learning of many digit symbols and an extended multiplication table. The invention of the positional notation attributed to the Sumerians or the Babylonians and developed by the Hindus was of enormous significance for the civilization. This system allows both operations of addition and multiplication. The previous numerical system used to support only addition. For example, in Roman symbols we write CXV111 equivalent to 100 plus 10 plus 5 plus 1 plus 1 plus 1. But now the best system that is most widely used is decimal system. Some others are the binary system and the hexadecimal system used in computers. Computation in systems other than decimal system is similar. It is just that the tables used are different. 
Before proceeding with an example of multiplication, in the septimal system, it is advisable to write down the tables we would have to use. Now we try to multiply 265 by 24, where these are written in the septimal system. The decimal equivalent would be 145 and 18. Just following the normal rules of multiplication, we begin with multiplying 5 with 4, which is 26 as per the multiplication table. We write 6 in the unit place, carrying the 2 in the next place. In this fashion, we can multiply all the values and get a multiplied value of 10416. This, when converted to decimal system, yields 2610, which is equal to 145 into 18. Thus, these two conversions are equivalent in nature. For a binary system, the properties of addition and multiplication are as follows. Laplace once quoted, Lemnius saw in binary arithmetic the image of creation. He imagined that unity represents God and zero the void. Well, that's all for today. Next, we'll learn about the principle of mathematical induction. So subscribe and stay tuned.